Hello folks and welcome back to the Video Gadgets Journal and as is customary on the channel whenever iOS updates to a new version number I go through the process of downloading Airshow the best iOS screen recorder currently available from the scratch and doing a screen recording to make sure that everything still works and give you assurances that if you do want to upgrade to the latest version of iOS it's worth doing and there is no harm to your recording of video games. Now just to confirm we are on iOS 10.2 too, and I do apologize that I am a little late to this party during the holiday season. I just haven't had time to update iOS, so perhaps you've already done that. But for anyone who hasn't done it, well, it's just better safe than be sorry. So I'm going to tap the install now button. And once we've completed the iOS update, I'll be back to install Airshow and give it a quick recording test. See you in about five minutes, or in the case of this video, three seconds. And we are back after the update. Let's check the version number. My iPad is now on 10.2. So let's go through the whole process of downloading Airshow and doing a screen recording. I know there are many alternatives now to locations where you can download Airshow, but I'm going to stick with Tutu since those are the people who got the application back up and running after the developers supported it the show developers and obviously uh, while they have continued to provide the broadcast version of our show which is 0 0.7 the version on 22 is 0 061 which is the one we need if we want to do screen recordings and as you can see I can find it through the application store of 22 and then install it and if you want more information on this method then you can go to the video that's probably in the link on screen now right about there so let's launch our show see if it's working it is of course working as I just did a second ago and it seems to go in fine check the version number we are on 061 so all is looking good so far all we need to do now is a screen recording and we'll do that with a quick setup of uh, the different options that I need which is portrait and 1080p and a good demonstration to uh, demo on this now these days is Super Mario Run so everything looks to be working fine so far the recording has started and what I will do now is put up the screen recording probably on the right side of the screen as I, I begin my uh, game of Super Mario Run. Now there doesn't look to be any sound here but that's probably not an issue. This tends to happen when you have a game already running but then you start the recording and it doesn't pick up the sound but if you can hear my voice uh, on the recording which I uh, hopefully you will do then that means that it was recording sounds from the microphone it just wasn't outputting any game sounds on this particular test so we'll play another couple of seconds before finishing the demo and I think that should be enough let's quit there go back to the recording we've got 45 seconds of recording go to the video recording which is there press play and with any luck we should have a recording that all looks good to me so I can safely say that without too many issues you'd obviously have to do a bit more testing to make sure that the playback is okay I think you can upgrade your iOS version to 10.2 and still be able to download and screen record using Airshow thank you very much for watching if you've got any questions do pop them in the comments below and indeed do check out my playlist which has a lot more coverage on iOS screen recording content and subscribe to the channel as I cover this on a near daily basis otherwise you know the drill enjoy the rest of your tech day bye for now